Hi, today I'm going to show you how to use Ableton's collect all and save function. This is really useful when you want to share your project with someone else and you've used samples or sounds from outside of Ableton's core library or any of the packs. Um, because what you see on the screen here is not the sound itself, but it's just a picture that represents the sound and you also need to share the actual samples or sounds. So the first thing we're going to do is save our project uh, into uh, as a new project. So I've just got here a project with two sounds that I've just grabbed from wherever. Uh, and first I'll, call, I'll go to save live set. You can go to save live set as, or uh, if it's a brand new project, as you can see, this one's called untitled, save live set. And I'm just gonna go to my HSMT folder and I'm gonna call it collect all demo for the purposes of this right now. And now you can see it's a it's a project called Collect All Demo in a folder also called Collect All Demo. And if you go and have a look at that folder right now, um, you can see there's the project and there's some project info, but the sounds themselves are not in there. And now that you've saved it, it's really simple. You just go File, Collect All and Save. Uh, and uh, you can assume that someone has the factory packs. If you're not sure, you would tick yes here, but I'm going to assume that uh, whoever I'm sharing it with, I, I mean, it doesn't even matter because I'm not using anything in this case from the factory packs, but if you were, it's always uh, healthy to tick yes there unless you're sure they've got the, the same packs as you. Click OK. And now if I go back to that same thing, you can see there's two new folders in there. There's a backup folder, which has just saved, did an auto save, which is really convenient. And also in here in samples imported, there's the first one. It's a sample from Harry Styles with the ASD file and in processed, there's the, uh, the other one there. So now um, this folder here contains everything I need. Now what I need to do is zip that up so I can share it. So if I go back to the containing folder, this is the project folder here, collect all demo in my case, and I'm gonna right click on it and just go compress. And that's gonna create a, a zip file which contains everything in there. Um, a common mistake is people then go into the folder and zip the ALS, but that's uh, not what we're trying to do here. What we wanna do is zip the folder that contains the project and the samples and so on. And then you just share that, the zip file that uh, if you have a look at the icon, uh, where is it? There it is. It looks like a little package that's been zipped up. Okay. I hope that's helpful for you.